YouTube animations have been around for a while now, guys, and it seems like they just keep on getting weirder and weirder. Today I've found potentially the most strange and weird and unnecessary animation that I have ever seen. I will go over it with you and we will take notes and there will be a quiz at the end. Please enjoy. And also press the like button in the next three seconds or I'll give you private swim lessons. Just kidding, guys. That's weird. <laughs> also subscribe. intro, Oompaville's editor and Oompaville, you got the whole squad laughing. <laughs> Turns out there's a few of these animation channels, guys. A few. Thinking even weirder and weirder and weirder. My swimming coach did things with me. Also, this was on their, their channel, guys. This video here was on their channel at some point. My name is Carrie, and I'm 17 years old. This will be fun. Already breaking the law. We're off to a good start, guys! For kind of an awkward pause there remember, at the very beginning. I've loved water. Anything to do with water. Okay. <laughs> Sipping on it, bathing in it. My mom likes to talk about how I was a water baby from day one. A water baby? What? <laughs> What's a water baby? Like a little baby that's swimming around like that Nirvana album cover? With his little wiener out and stuff? A little baby thing? Huh? <laughs> She's really ugly whenever she turns to the side. <laughs> didn't try to animate her. She jokes about how it must be because she gave birth to me naturally what? in a paddling pool. Uh, why would you do that? But she was determined to have me with no drugs okay. at home. Well, okay, well, your mom's a fucking psychopath. Did she also speak to the trees and have a charged amethyst in her back pocket? At all times! Because I do. All right, guys. I got some charged crystals. Just kidding. My mom oh, is God. determined. <laughs> so that's exactly <laughs> the lady's like, what the fuck? What the fuck? We did mommy baby swim classes. Is it just me or does she have a disturbingly short torso and a giant Disney movie baby head thing and some frog hands? The proportions are all off. Have you ever seen a child? I was always the <laughs> smallest kid in every swimming level. <laughs> I was always the kid with the smallest torso. <laughs> I had secret dreams of becoming an Olympic swimmer. Well, let me just say that. Those dreams ain't gonna work out too good, because I know the title of this video. All right. Let's just say I, I got a little insight into what's about to happen here, guys. Something bad is about to happen here. This isn't an animation that should really be on YouTube. The worst part is, it's probably not even a real story. The first day of swim team was so exciting for me. I got I to bet. meet my coach, Being Jim, a water baby and, and all. others on my team. Oh, it was Jim, cool that's to Jim? Him. You're disgusting. Who loved what about the guy in the thumbnail? <laughs> the old, bald, <laughs> Putin-looking guy. <laughs> Wait a second, it's the begging section. Press like if you want to see another animation video. Caption this image. I'll give you a few seconds to caption it. Here are the best captions, okay? I like that one. I like that one. I like that one. I like that one. I really like that one! And also buy the merch, link down below, supports the channel. Thank you guys, please enjoy. Jim in his marshmallow arms. Jim is also misshapen. He's got terrible foot posture. Look at that. Why are they so wide and flared out? All the girls on the team had crushes mm, on Jim. I'm sure they did. With a name like he Jim. He was very good looking, I must okay, admit. Even with the f and of course, dead he grass had that on his lean head. and muscular swimmer's physique that didn't hurt either. Yes. Very lean and muscular. I can see the striations. Looks like he was built out of Play-Doh by like a six-year-old baby. At our first swim meet, we oh, did I love the animations. <laughs> I came in first place. Oh yeah. Woo! Go water, baby! Jim scooped me up in his I'm arms sure he did. and spun me around. I'm sure he did. Then, then what? But I figured that as we were his first swim team, he was just extra excited that it was working out. And then he did the illegal stuff. How old is Jim, by the way? Because that's really important. He pulled me aside after the oh, meet in no. the parking lot. He told me that I reminded him a lot of himself oh, at wow. my age. And that he saw that's limitless cringe. potential in me. That's very cringy. He asked if I'd be interested in private coaching oh, wow. sessions once a week. We've seen this before, guys. We've seen this before. Come on, get to the good part. Get to the good part. Come on. I told him we didn't have a lot of money and that I couldn't pay him for private coaching lessons. Oh, shit. Looks like we're gonna have to barter. He said that he wasn't doing it for the money. That's code for illegal. He said, What'd he say? I think, though, we shouldn't mention it to the rest of the team. Okay. So I hesitantly agreed to keep it oh, between us. It doesn't seem like you hesitantly agreed. It looks like you enthusiastically agreed. That night at home, 
I was on top of the moon. Jesus Christ, where the fuck do you live in like a $5 million apartment in the middle of New York City? Damn, you were a water baby and you're rich? As well, a money baby? When I heard my phone beep, I was surprised to see that Jim had texted it's me. It's Jim on Messenger. Obviously, he had my number from the team list. Bruh. But it still threw me off. Jim! He messaged me the time to meet at the pool. He's sliding him in at eight o'clock. Eight o'clock at the pool. I was just happy to get the one-on-one -on -one guidance. That's yes. I was also happy to get my first one-on-one -on -one guidance. If you know exactly what I am saying, guys, no, this is not a joke. This is real. This is a real moment. I'm an adult virgin. It was hard to not tell my friends where I was <laughs> What going is that right face, now. dude? <laughs> and met him at the pool at eight. Oh, I love the walking animations. That was great. They pulled off my track pants and top. Oh my God. I couldn't help but feel like he was staring at me. Yeah, I'm sure he was, dude. I looked up just in time to see him quickly glance away. Oh, wow. It looked like he just f flipped. Like he just did a horizontal flip. Like he's some kind of 2D object almost. Like he's not even in a three-dimensional space. What is this, a fake story? You really think someone would do that? Just go on the animated story section on YouTube. And tell lies? Jim has tiny feet, so. Dove in the pool. Okay, yeah, that was not a dive, but sure. Lap after oh, wow. lap. wow, okay, Jim's naked I basically now. Up. Jesus Christ. He was trying to show me some new technique that I wasn't I quite getting, so he hopped in the pool with me. Okay. I couldn't help but notice he Yikes. was wearing skimpy Speedos rather than yes. his usual swimming shorts. Yes. I tried not to stare. <laughs> At what? At what? Girl, I forgot her name. Jim ain't packing, all right? It's obvious. Jim ain't fucking packing. He's got dead grass on his head and his arms are this tall. He came up behind me and took a hold of my arm. I almost oh. jumped. Oh. God. Relax, this is really said. awkward. I'm just Don't going to hold your arms in the right relax. form until you get it. Don't ever let anyone tell you to relax. Then Please no. Laps. Run away from Jim right now or whatever you're doing. The one side of the Slide. When he hover. started to splash me playfully. <laughs> Jim. We were laughing and splashing each other. Love the animation. I dove okay. under the water and swam dun, in the opposite dun, direction. Dun, 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 As he closed in on me, the pool. <laughs> he swam up close to me until he was inches away from my face. Okay. I was beyond shocked to suddenly feel his hands on my hips under the water. Okay. What are you doing? His answer Jim. was that he wanted to work on my form some more. Mm. I knew at that point. He That's wasn't code for about swimming. Breaking the law in some states. Um, I think All maybe states. I should go. Okay. He pressed his body yeah, what the into mine so I couldn't oh. go oh. anywhere. Okay, this isn't funny. I was pinned between his powerful chest Punt. and the edge of the pool. You didn't have to use the word powerful. That's like a endearing an endearing adjective. You don't use that word, okay? His law well, you can't really use that one either. His muscular, hairy, glistening chest. I'm getting hungry. I was even more disturbed okay. to feel that he was getting excited under the water. Oh! Okay, I get it, I get it, I understand, I understand, I get it, I understand. Okay, Let punch him go. and call the police! Punch him and call the police! Punch him and call the police! He started to move his Okay, this is not funny. Of my body. This is terrible! Call the police! They moved up my ribs. Okay, yep. And stopped just on the sides of my pillow. Oh no, not the- I'm gonna look away. I had only kissed one boy before. Oh shit, one boy? And I certainly didn't want what he was doing. Okay, punch him in the face and call the police. He started Run to away. his thumbs around in circles on the side of each chest. Okay. Anyways. He told myself that if I just was quiet, The music is not stop. really... And then I could go home. What? Okay. Instead, he leaned the music is weird. started to gently brush the droplets of water off my okay. cheeks. Okay, anyways. He started to kiss my which cheeks. Which cheeks? Okay, which ones? I turned my head. Playing hard to get, okay. hey? No, actually, just not liking what's happening here. Thank goodness he pushed off and swam away. I quickly jumped out of the pool and wrapped myself in a towel. Okay, and then called the police? And he said he would see me the next day in practice. Okay, that's really weird. That's really weird. Call the police as well. Bring the police escort. He shouted something after me. Hey, wait a second. Just remember, I'm your coach, and I'm a good coach. <laughs> No. no one else can help you like I can. Okay, this is a classic power struggle. If you tell anyone about this, you'll not only embarrass yourself, you'll hurt the whole team and your future as a professional swimmer. What the fuck? I knew he was right. I just yawned. I'm starting to think that this story might not be real. The scariest thing about all this is, is imagine making a fake story like this. Because all these are fake. It says real amazing stories. This doesn't seem real. And it also doesn't seem amazing at all. This definitely seems like something that has happened before. Just because you copy the story of David and Goliath and freaking write it down with, and just change the names doesn't mean you didn't copy the story of David and Goliath, okay? And also... This is 
culturally inappropriate for children on YouTube. I tried to formulate a strategy of what to do. Call the police? He wasn't just going to stop. Bring a gun? I certainly didn't want to quit the swim team. Okay, run away. Put your slippers on, those giant <laughs> slippers. Everything seemed back to normal. That was until he whispered to me that my oh, form no. was looking better than ever. Oh, yeah, it's because he helped, isn't it? Maybe you should just tell him thank you. <laughs> just kidding, I didn't. I didn't say that. <laughs> I tried to think of some God. way to get out of it. Just don't go. He had started texting me hey, more and hey, more. Hey, hey, hi, and the hey, night before, how are you? He sent me a picture how of himself you? in his Speedo. Oh my God. Here's a picture of me in a Speedo with dead grass on my head, with a bush on my head. When one of my swim friends walked in on me crying the next day, <laughs> I okay. couldn't hold this it isn't in funny, any guys. longer. This isn't funny, guys. I told her everything. Okay. And together, we hatched a plan to get revenge. What was the plan? That night at our oh, private session, session, we were going to put our plan into motion. Okay. What the fuck? Are you fucking kidding me? You're gonna fucking leave me hanging like that? What the fuck is wrong with you? Also, I love the guy that they put in the thumbnail. It's obscene. It's absurd. It's nothing like Jim. That's a creepy old Santa Claus looking man. Jim is handsome and has... A tumbleweed on his head. So Came after back. figuring it out the hard way that yeah. things were only going to What's get worse. What's your name worse. again? Carrie? My Something? friend and I decided that okay. coach or not. Kill him. Kill him. Stab him in the center of his chest. Why is he standing like that, by the way? They're standing normal and he's standing like he's a <laughs> against a wall or something. Sure enough, when I saw headlights pulling into There's the parking Jim. lot. What's he drive? It looks Jim. like a, a beetle. Dude, he drives a Volkswagen beetle. <laughs> okay, activating the plan. Message. All right, we're starting, and there here we go. Turning back. Here we go. The plan is activated, guys. I'm stressing. What is she gonna do to him? Katie pulled into the parking lot. Oh, she gonna drive through the window? He squinted out into the night. Jim, he's like, Ugh. Hey, isn't that your friend Katie coming in? Yes, it is. Yup, it is. It is Jim. I said, It is Jim. In my most seductive voice, I said, <laughs> I thought you might like to turn this twosome into a threesome. Okay, I just lost all sympathy. For all parties involved, this is fucking absurd. My voice uh, sounded so strange and unnatural Jim said, in my head. Hello, hello, hello. Jim didn't seem to know. Hello, hello, hello. His eyes hello, hello. widened and then his hello, hello. Hello. the biggest smile I had ever seen. <laughs> Heck yeah. Heck yeah, bud. Let's get down on to it. Woo! Do you mind if I join you guys? God, this is weird. But I just got this new bikini. Why? And I really want to try it out. Okay. Katie slowly unbuttoned her dress, keeping okay. in contact with Jim the entire okay, time. That's really weird. Katie this was This is gorgeous. really weird. There was no doubt about it. Yeah, she's a ginger woman. That's beautiful. She had the longest legs on a girl I had ever seen. Absurdly long. I mean, if you really, if you like look at this and you compare, your legs are a solid six inches longer. Looks like she's packing heat though. Be honest. Looks like old Katie or whatever the fuck her name is. I'm really bad with names. She hopped in the pool and made a big show about how cold the okay. water was. Oh yeah, I wonder what that means. Jim swam up to her and said, "Is water so cold my freaking nips could cut diamonds?" Maybe I can warm you up. That's weird. Maybe you can, she said. Cringe, cringe, fake. Lost all sympathy, fake. And I was starting to worry. Fake. Our plan wasn't going to work. What's the plan though? Jim called me over and said that we could all help each other stay warm. Maybe Katie's on Jim's side now. Maybe she. Did, maybe she's a double agent. When I swam over. He put an arm around my waist, and the oh, other gosh. around Katie's. Oh, gosh. Isn't this better? No, it's not. Run! Katie purred into his ear that she was finally starting to warm up. Dude, Katie's a fucking... And I couldn't believe just how good she was at this. What is happening? Jim started to kiss my neck. Jim, no! It's a trap, Jim! And then she said she needed to use the bathroom and would be oh. right back. She gotta go take a poop. Jim reluctantly let her go. Mid-swim poop. Her like a hawk as she swam across the pool. She gotta take a mid-swim poop. That was more of a slide, by the way. Once again, they don't swim or move or walk. They <laughs> slide around like goddamn weeblers that wobble but don't fall down. They don't have legs. Their legs are non-functioning. I was starting to wonder if this was all a bad mistake. Yeah. Honestly, it seems like a terrible mistake to me. I'm an idiot. Could Katie really pull it off? What is it? What are you talking about? Now, it was go time. What? Katie was treading water in the middle of the pool and looking coyly at Jim. What the fuck? I swam over next, and we started our planned splash fight. Oh my... <sighs> Katie was hanging on to Jim and squealing while I swam up behind wee, him. Wee, 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 I took a deep wee, breath and <laughs> dove under the water. Oh no! One quick swoop, I was able to yank Jim's trunks down. Before he seemed to know what was happening, I was at the other end of the pool with his trunks and was getting out. Katie said to him, don't worry, we're next. He seemed a little uneasy, but didn't do anything. Uh. 
while Jim was distracted looking the opposite way at Katie, pretending she was going to strip down. I don't understand. I quietly gathered up Jim's bag, his towel. What are you guys doing? I put them next to the door, slipped my tracksuit on, I and don't... gestured to Katie. <sighs> Katie grabbed her bag and ran out the door. Jim is a dumb idiot, guys. Look After at her him. With my stuff. Dead grass and on his head. We were oh, laughing yeah? hysterically as we watched Jim frantically <laughs> getting out of the pool, <gasps> completely <gasps> naked, and looking for I mean, his he, towel. He's not naked, though. I don't. We knocked on the he's big not window naked and at waved his bag fuck? and towel at him. Have I been lied to? This is what you get when you pick on smart girls. Okay. He said they're not he that smart, but sure. He would never do it again. Oh my God! No, he we didn't. He's wearing a speedo. Part one of our revenge plan, but there was still part two. What's that? What's part two? Katie and I both volunteered for AV, audio visual duty at the school. Okay. That meant we got to go to school before anyone else and set up all the video equipment in the classrooms. So okay. it was all ready to roll Nerds. when the teachers got there. Oh no, what's gonna happen? Is Jim about to get his whole life ruined by the a B AV club? There was also something called RHTV, which was basically a daily announcement that was delivered no. through video Don't. to the entire school. Don't do it, Carrie and Katie. Every room had a projector screen that was pulled down. And oh RHTV my God! What are you doing? As nine o'clock approached and we knew everyone was settling into their classrooms oh waiting for the announcement. Those are some tiny we little people. Both giddy with fear and excitement. Giddy. <laughs> knew we would get in trouble for what we were about to do. Of course. But we're more it's probably illegal. In making Jim pay. Okay, this is messed up. But what about the the future of your 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 swimming career though? And then I passed her the paper with the speech we had worked on the night before. Oh no! What is going on right now? Not too long ago, <laughs> our fine school was blessed with the arrival of our new swimming coach. Jim. Jim is a professional swimmer oh with lots to God. offer the members of his team. No. Especially took to my friend Carrie here and was even so kind as to offer her private coaching lessons. Wow. Jim touched Carrie in ways no coach should ever touch a student. Oh. And when she asked him to stop, she was threatened. What you're about to see, Carrie and I did together on behalf of every female who has ever been put in this position. Yes, female power. Women! It showed us splashing away in the pool, then Jim holding both of us. The best part, though, was of Jim totally naked and pounding on the pool's window to give him back his clothes. To make a long story short, we were suspended for our stunt, but we didn't mind. Jim was fired that very day. Well, you really got him. That was 26 minutes of just worthless woman power ah! i'm trapped in my own skin